We heard explosions from the other side of the reservoir. The air alarm was on all the time. When Russian forces attacked Europe's largest nuclear power plant, this family was only four miles away and escaped at the first opportunity. They want our territory because Putin believes that it is historically Russian territory and we should be in one state. But our Ukraine is a free and independent state. Valentina's granddaughter thinks the Russian military will fail and offered two simple reasons why. I think because Ukrainians are very strong and they love their people. More than 200 orphans also arrived here over the weekend by train. They too were fleeing the violence at the nuclear power plant. Lviv's mayor says 50,000 people pass through the city's train station a day. A majority continue on to Poland. For the past five days, this crew has been working round the clock to prepare 5,000 meals for refugees flooding into the train station here in Lviv. This makeshift soup kitchen sprang up through the generosity of local volunteers. Everybody wants some, uh, some help. Ukrainians serving their country away from the battlefield through acts of generosity. I don't uh, take weapons. I cook. I take this spoon. I take this fork. I spoke to one resident of this city who says she hopes the Russian soldiers go to hell and learn the history of this country. In Lviv, Ukraine, Lucas Tomlinson, Fox News.